Hey, hi! Hello there! Today, we're jumping over to the SJW capital of the internet, Tumblr. And today, we're going hunting. For other kin. Now basically, other kin are these 14 and 15 year old kids that think that deep down they're supposed to be some kind of animal or like mythical creature. Now I like to think of other kin as uh, furries but without the fursuit or without the nasty hentai that they do. Now a lot of these guys like to identify as like dragon kins where they're like part dragon or something like that. I've seen a lot of angel kin for some reason. They think they're like a fallen angel because that's so badass, right? I saw one that was a wolf kin, so that's the kind of shit that they like. But let me show you around. Let me show you what they're doing. You can strip me of my wings, my strength, my scales, and my regal looks. You may take my horns, my fangs, my great teeth and claws, but you can never take away my spirit. I will forever be elegant and fierce and intense. You cannot strip me of who I am. Dragonkin. A fucking dragon. You can strip me of my wings, mom. You can send me to my room. You can take away Game of Thrones on my phone. But you know what? I'm still a dragon. I'm still a dragon. Look at this. This guy made a whole post about how to be fit as a dragon guy. Martial arts. Not only are they great for dragons that love to fight and have aggression they need to vent, they're also great for fire breathers. So if you're a fire breathing dragon, good news, you should try martial arts. That'll really help you. Holy shit. Many styles incorporate a strong cry that comes from the diaphragm, and that's the closest I've ever felt to roaring or breathing fire in this life. Granted, I, I don't know what it's like to breathe fire, but the analogy has been made by others. Just saying. If you want to lose weight as a dragon, you know, if you're not going to Weight Watchers, you should try this post. Kin call! Looking to meet more people who are wolfkin, dragonkin, feykin. What, what is a feykin? I don't know what the hell that is. Like a fairy? Love the angel who leaves gold dust on everything they touch. They can't help leaving traces of divinity wherever they walk. Oh, I love that. When, when an angel walks by me and just leaves dust everywhere, Totally, yeah, I love angel kin. Oh yeah. Do you guys remember the wind under your wings? I do too. Hashtag angel kin. Hashtag dragon kin. Are you both? Hashtag wing kin. Hashtag any kin with wings. Hashtag fey kin. Fair, fair kin. Insect kin. Every kind of kin. You want to be kin with an insect? Like what, a beetle? You want to be insect kin like a fucking housefly? Is that what you want? I feel like I have a million eyes and they're just looking everywhere. And when I land anywhere, I just want to rub my hands together. I think I'm a fly kin, you guys. You guys. What if there was like an other kin summer camp? Where kin could go and meet each other and theorians could be in nature and there would be crafts and different kin types and ah! Good God. Yeah, you guys would need a summer camp because you're all just a bunch of fucking kids who don't know what the hell they're talking about, man. Let's play. Was that my wing or something else? Ha! <laughs> Relatable angel kin post. Am I right, guys? Yeah. This is this is the first good kin I've seen. All right, listen to this. Family guy kin. If you're also Lois Griffin, don't follow. Stewies, don't interact. I'm looking for my Peter. This one makes sense to me. I identify with Lois. I, I feel like I'm Lois kin, you know? There's a big blog for this kind of stuff called Kin Experiences, where people post like relatable stuff, you know? It's supposed to be like a relatable meme kind of thing. I hate it so much when video games make me kill the animal I'm kin with. Ah, I hated shooting that wolf. I'm kin with wolves. Please don't make me kill my kin. TKFW, you're wearing fake horns and it's super bittersweet because on one hand it's wonderful to feel the weight of horns and see a silhouette that is closer to the true you, but on the other hand it's heartbreaking to know that they will only be flimsy foam with plastic things. So relatable, you guys. I wish I had horns for my goat kin. I'm a mountain goat kin. Eighth grade math is too hard for me. So I just pretend to be a mountain goat, you know? Ah, you guys, you guys get that? That's so relatable, man. My wings are almost always aching. I've seen doctors to make sure it's nothing physically wrong and they never find anything. It feels like God must hate me and that's why I've fallen so far. No, you're not a fucking angel, okay? You're not. You're a normal kid. You're 14. You probably have a crush on some kid in chemistry, alright? 
Okay, I want to submit something and see if they'll let it through as a fake, like, kin shit thing. I want to see if they'll take that. I'm gonna pretend to be a kin. What kin should I be? I'll be a- I'll be a stapler kin. <laughs> I'll be a stapler. Here, let me type something up real quick. We'll be back in a second. I hate seeing everyone abuse office supplies. Especially staplers and tape dispensers. My kin. It's so demeaning and it honestly hurts my soul every time I see it happen. Do not abuse staplers. They are people too. I am stapler kin, okay? Respect me. Thank you. Have you ever seen a broken stapler? Every time I see a stapler with no staples in it, I can hear it calling out to me. It's crying out for help. And nobody does anything. It is disgusting. It is so... <laughs> Damn it. It's so demeaning. Okay, I'm gonna fucking submit this thing. I know they're gonna- they're probably not gonna post this. I fucking doubt they're gonna post this, but I wanna put it in. <laughs> thank you! Oh, thank you so much! Well, I- I seriously doubt- they're not gonna- they're not gonna post that thing, but that was a lot of fun. <laughs> That's it for this thing. Um... Subscribe.